So this is pre-tension loading to the back part of your hip, right in through this area. So you're going to need a platform that's about knee height. You're going to place your foot on top of it just like so, so that your ankle, your knees, and your hip create roughly about a 90 degree angle. From there, the first step you want to do is you want to post anterior pelvic tilt. So basically, pretend like your pelvis is a pitcher of water and you're trying to dump the water in front of you. So when you do that, when you anterior pelvic tilt, your back is slightly going to curve and your tush is going to stick out a little bit more. You're going to hold this position throughout this whole uh, process. First thing you're going to do is you're going to slightly bend forward at your trunk, bending at your hip, so that you feel more tension in this back stuff. From there, you're going to hold that position and then you're just going to let the knee go in or out. Nice, slow and controlled until you feel a little bit more of a load in this back stuff. When you go in front, you might feel a little pinch in the front part of your hip. Just be careful of that. So once you find the tension, the increase of tension, you're going to hold that position. And then with the trunk, you can bend a little bit more forward and hold that tension. Once you reach a tension, then you're going to twist your body. You're going to twist it towards the knee that's up or twist it away from the knee that's up. And I feel more tension turning this direction, so I'm going to hold that. From that position, I'm going to side bend one direction or side bend the opposite direction. So when I side bend, I'm lowering the shoulder down towards the same side hip. And I feel more tension when I'm side bending this shoulder down towards that hip, and I'm just going to hold that there. Since that is the last motion, I'm going to undo that and then redo the side bend and trying to go a little bit more than the previous attempt and hold that there. And I should feel the tension all in the back stuff right here. Come out of it and then go back into it, trying to go a little bit more, being a little bit more intentional about going a little bit further and holding it there for a second or two.